When you think of Jello, you may think. Oh boy! Thanks, Mom! But we scientific scholars like to examine Jello in terms of its ingredients. Let's see how much you know about your favorite afternoon snack. Did you know that one of the main ingredients of Jello is gelatin? What's gelatin? Gelatin is a processed version of the structural protein called collagen. You mean like those lip injections that movie stars get? Sure, but do you know why collagen has that rejuvenating effect on lips and other body parts? Because it's the most abundant protein that's found in animals and humans. Let me start with the basics. Collagen is the main support protein of connective tissue. It is very strong and it is the main component of ligaments and tendons. It is also contractile and responsible for skin elasticity. That's why a decrease in collagen throughout the years leads to more wrinkles and possible joint pains. Collagen is composed of many amino acids, including glycine, proline, and hydroxyproline, wound together with hydrogen bonds and helix-like polypeptide chains. Okay, okay, but how does collagen link to gelatin? When collagen is heated in water, its triple helix structure unwinds and the chains separate. The coils dissolve randomly in the water and become gelatin. When you put the gelatin in the refrigerator, its molecules lose energy after they have dissociated and bond together, forming the one main ingredient of your snack called jello. But wait! I still don't understand how jello goes from liquid to solid form. Well, bonding occurs at different points along the triple helix, which forms pockets that trap large amounts of water, resulting in a semi-solid colloid. These colloids allow the solid gelatin to disperse throughout the water and absorb water until it becomes, along with the other ingredients, jello. Is jello actually healthy for me since it contains collagen, a protein? Not really. Jello lacks much nutritional value apart from energy because the other main ingredient is a ton of sugar. Wait a second. I think I remember my grandma telling me that gelatin lacks the tryptophan, an essential amino acid that makes protein nutritious. That would make jello truly healthy for me. That's right. But I always say you can never get too much collagen.